Hey guys, Gameplay Vids 24 7 here. Welcome back to my Clicker Heroes playthrough. So, ladies and gentlemen, we are back here on Clicker Heroes. Welcome, everyone. Welcome back. <laughs> so, it's been, I think, three days since I played Clicker Heroes last. Uh, very, very different to what I usually do on my channel, but yeah, usually I post every single day. But yeah, I thought I'd have a little break, and it seems you guys have missed me quite a bit here, so yeah, I thought I'd record again some Clicker Heroes. Pretty much I'm going to be doing a big change on my channel, guys. going to try and aim for mainly one video a day on my channel, instead of spamming heaps of uploads, so yeah. By the way, if you guys enjoyed today's episode, please remember to hit that like and subscribe button if you did. And of course, thank you all very much for watching, okay? Uh, please be sure to leave me a comment as well, telling me if you are still playing Clicker Heroes, okay? Because I know we're about 354 episodes in, I'm fairly sure now. And I know I've gained lots of people that like Clicker Heroes, like watching my videos. And I know heaps of them have dropped off the map as well. Because Clicker Heroes is actually quite old now, once you think about it. Uh, but yeah, either way, what situation are we in right now, guys? We have to have a look here. So we have Dread Knight. We'll put 100 levels into Dread Knight. Very good. We're back to actually one-shotting the mobs here, which is great. So now that Dread Knight's at 100, I think we can try and go back to the Power 5 combination here, ladies and gentlemen. If need be, we can even just level up Mars Samurai and the Great Forest Seer, so maybe that's something we'll probably look into. We do have some Mercenary Quest rewards to collect now, we'll just get that done quickly. We'll kind of wait until we're at some sort of wall, though, before we collect these gold rewards, I think. It might be the easiest thing. Uh, ooh, quite a bit of Hero Souls to claim here as well, which is great to see. Should we perhaps collect these rewards now? That's the thing. I don't know. Because we get, uh, what, around 26% 20, or so uh, worth of a quick ascension. At the moment, that's 4.5, 33E6. Hmm. Choices. Okay, what I'll do, I'll wait until I'm about to ascend, and then I might claim those souls, okay? It's probably the easiest thing. Now, right now, what we're going to end up doing is actually leveling up the Mars Samurai by 100, Great Forest Air by 100. So, we're going to be going in between these two right now to see who's going to give us the most damage, okay? So, Mars Samurai actually has a Gilded status within him. So, how many uh, Gilded statuses does Mars Samurai have? 108 Gilded statuses inside the Mars Samurai right now, which is great to see. Uh, almost at 400, ladies and gentlemen, which is very nice as well. Thanks to this being the more... Uh, I guess, slow pace part of the pre-transcension, or should I say, no, post-transcension. Uh, it's a bit, you know, difficult to try and keep you guys interested. So I'm going to try my hardest here to keep you guys watching. Please be sure to let me know if you watch this video all the way to the end as well. It really would make my day, okay? Um, YouTube's going through some hard times now, guys. So yeah, it's very hard for content creators to actually make any type of living from YouTube now, so it's all just for the, the fun and the passion of it. <laughs> Pretty much what it should be in the first place once you think about it. But yeah, so many people are leaving YouTube now, it's quite crazy. Let's go... We'll yeah, switch between the 100 levels here. There we go, 1500 Mars Samurai, 1500 Mars... Uh, no, the Great Forest Seer. So Mars Samurai is pulling off 81.29% of our total damage. Great Forest Seer is taking the rest of that force there and 18.70%. There you go. Now, if we were to put 25 levels into Great Forest here, I think we'd get a more decent percentage there of DPS gained over the Mars Samurai. But because Mars Samurai is usually the cheapest for damage at this level, I think we'll probably end up still going into the Mars Samurai here, ladies and gentlemen. I am not going to put an auto clicker on the Mars Samurai right now, because I do prefer to get that extra gold boost from Nogranit. Right now, we have four auto clickers actually gaining gold for us, which is always good to see, of course. Uh, we still can't level up Atlas, which is quite frustrating. Let's see clan-wise. How are we looking clan-wise now? Uh, mod was this a modular? Blixer, 4800. Might be a bit, a little bit too low, perhaps. I'll let you in, though. But Super Tony 14, gonna have to reject and reject and reject, because you're too low, my friends. Alright, so the clan boss. What's he on? 56. Interesting. Let's see, what are the levels now of my clan? Very interesting indeed. I'm actually not the lowest person in my clan, which is actually a welcome change, everyone. That makes me quite happy indeed. Uh, what we'll do, we'll level up my Samurai some more. I think we'll, we won't worry about the Great Forest here anymore. We'll just continue to level up the Mars Samurai. My Samurai should deliver that really, really extra 
like, amount of damage that we'll need to progress later on. Hopefully, if all goes to plan here. I mean, we can't level up Atlas just yet, which is quite frustrating as well. But yeah, there's not much you can really do at the moment. Almost at 450 here, guys, which is great to see. Let's check out our Ancients now, shall we? We have a level 18 Atman, level 16 Kuma, level 1224 Libertas, 296 Nogrenet, 1321 Silatus. Solomon is at a pretty solid 623. So you can't really complain with that Solomon level though, but improvements could obviously be made. Next Ascension, we're gonna, I'm going to try and level up Solomon a bit more than what I usually would. Just because I want to try and get those extra hero souls, guys, from those primal bosses, obviously, okay? Now, we can start another quest here, so just bear with me. We're going to be chucking... The, yeah, we'll go for the 50% chance of a ruby. How are our rubies looking right now? 215 rubies. Pretty good. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Alright, I'm not going to complain with that either. That's a pretty decent number. Level up my Samurai some more. Hopefully we can try and push Mars Samurai to 2,000 this episode. We'll have to see how we go, though. This is where I really like showing you guys, the viewers, like, how powerful the Mars Samurai is around this level. But with the Gilded statuses in him, he's extremely effective, man. Uh, absolutely love using the, the Mars Samurai at this point in the game. Until the point, I guess, we get to Atlas. When we unlock Atlas, then... You know, things might change, but for now, we'll stick to the Mars Samurai, okay? Amenhotep, uh, we'll try and, yes, yeah, get to Ascension. We won't Ascend just yet, obviously. We'll wait to Ascend, guys, okay? Don't you worry about that. Uh, level up the Mars Samurai some more. Very good indeed. Just having a look here. Doing quite well, man. 500. Look, if we can get to 500... Without any issues, I have a feeling we'll probably get to even 600 in today's episode. Hell, if we could push 700, I'd be extremely happy, but the chances of that happening are quite low, sadly. So we just got to see what happens, okay? Almost at 500 now, which is excellent. I wonder if I can get Atlas in this part, dude. I reckon I should be able to technically get Atlas. We'll see what happens. Just got another clickable there, ladies and gentlemen. Very nice. Almost at 1700 Mars Samurai. We should be able to hit him very, very soon. Then again, that means we can get Atlas soon as well, because now we're up to the E56 category now of gold. Atlas is at a whopping E56 as well, but 6.1. So realistically now, I could actually start saving up for Atlas and start moving my Gilded Statuses into Atlas if I really, really wanted to. Which I think that might be something I'll probably end up doing, to be honest. As soon as I have the choice to actually level up Atlas, I'll get it done. Let's go 1700 now into the Masked Samurai. Almost up to 500. We're doing super well, ladies and gentlemen. Always good to see. Always good to see. Here we go, 500 guys. Big Primal Boss, lovely. 26,000 Hero Souls in the bank. Can't complain with that one bit. You've got to admit. We're doing actually really, really well in today's episode, aren't we? Atlas. 25 levels now into Atlas, guys, okay? We'll chuck our Gilded Status is inside Atlas as well there. Very nice. Purchase Resurrection. 100% DPS boost to Atlas. Purchase Band of Brothers, another 100% DPS boost to Atlas. Let's go for another 25 levels into Atlas. Get that clickable. Got the extra ruby. 216 rubies now in total. Purchase Medic as well. Another 100% damage boost to Atlas. So 300% boost in total right now. I'm gonna try and save up for that big fully charged ability. That gives us an another 150% boost there, which is very nice indeed. trying... Uh, yeah, I think we'll forget about Master Samurai for now. There's no point in Master Samurai. I think what I'll end up doing tonight, ladies and gentlemen, is start grinding offline again. We'll start making some great progression while we're offline. 
and yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll get to hopefully past 6,000 by the end of this next transcension, okay? My zone ever should definitely be past 6,000 on my next transcension. It has to be. We need to make it, dude. We need to get there. Fully charged. We need to get fully charged. Level 100 Atlas. Shouldn't take us too long, theoretically. We've got to see how it goes. Almost at 550 here, guys. We're just trying to collect all this gold now. <laughs> Come on. Nice. Collecting, collecting, collecting. Nice big treasure chest there. That's given us a nice amount of gold. Fully charged now for Atlas, guys. Level 100 Atlas. We should be okay now for offline grinding as well, especially. Should make some really nice progression, hopefully, if all goes well. Five hundred and forty-six there, almost up to five fifty. This is exactly pretty much what you want to see in Clicker Heroes, guys. You really want to get to that point where you can sort of, I guess, do things in the background while Clicker Heroes is on the screen. Uh, when you're one-shotting mobs, this is really the best thing to do. <laughs> really, like if I wanted to, I could put the auto clicker on right now and just go play another game if I really, really wanted to. Okay. But, for the sake of the series, I'm going to make sure I always do what I've done for the last 353 episodes, or 354 including this one. Show every bit of progression. This time around though, it's going to be much different to what it used to be. This time I'm actually making proper progression and playing the game as it should be played. So yeah, I do hope you guys enjoy uh, these episodes now, what I'm going to be making in the future. They're going to be shorter, but they're going to be packed with much more content instead of empty noise, if that makes sense. So. I feel like it's something that has to be done for the series now. Since Clicker Heroes is getting quite old now, sadly, as much as I hate to admit it, Clicker Heroes is getting older. Uh, Clicker Heroes 2 still has not been announced properly, like a release date. So I'm just really trying to make do what I can here on Clicker Heroes, guys. Trying to make it as interesting as I can, even though it's quite an old game now. And I do appreciate you guys sticking through to the end. Let me know in the comments if you watch to the end, okay? Once we get to 600, I think we'll wrap it up for today's episode, guys, because I feel like there's not much progression that's going to happen on camera here that you guys haven't seen already. So we'll do it offline. I think, yeah, once we hit 600, we'll end the episode and I'll grind offline, try and get past where I was in today's episode tomorrow uh, while we're offline, okay? So when we come back tomorrow, theoretically, we should be at least at 1,000, hopefully, without a shadow of a doubt. <laughs> we'll see what happens, though. Only 19 more levels. Let's try and get Alice to 200 here, guys. We should be able to without any issues. We're gonna make some nice progression still. Just gonna think, what's next for us? I mean, I guess we have Terra. Hmm. Five hundred and ninety-one. Okay. Can we get to 595? Let's have a look. Yeah, no issues at all, man. We got this in the bag. That's what I like to see, dude. That's exactly what I like to see. Good stuff, man. Absolute domination. Gotta love it. That's it, guys. That's it for today's episode. Brilliant. Alright, so, thank you so much for watching today's episode, guys. I really hope that you all did enjoy. Uh, Gonna be getting back into Clicker Heroes every day. Shorter episodes, but much, much more content, obviously. I'm gonna do what I'm good at. Gonna keep you guys entertained, okay? So, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I will catch you all tomorrow for the next part of my Clicker Heroes playthrough. Uh, if I play another game as well, be sure to check that out. I don't know what I wanna play. I just feel like playing major releases from now on, but who knows? Either way, cheers, guys, for watching. See you all tomorrow, okay? See you around. Thanks again.